I look so bloody punk rock right now. Today I'm gonna be doing a video on what I'm packing for my Trek America. I'm really bloody excited about it. What Trek America is, is it's basically this website you can go on. It's, it's a brand for Trek America. And what it is, is organized treks throughout America and you can pick like how long you want to go for, what kind of trek you want to do, where you want to go. Um, I happen to be doing a West Coast America, so I'm starting in LA and I'm finishing in San Francisco. And over these eight days, I'm going to be trekking. So I'm going to be trekking, hiking, camping, and it's just going to be really bloody cool. I'm also going to be, the thing is, it's like I'm also going to be, I'm spending like the first eight days trekking and then I'm going to be spending another six days in LA because me and Matthew are going to fly back to LA and do like LA. So I kind of have to pack for two holidays if that makes any sense. So I'm just going to be showing what I'm going to be packing, focusing on the actual trekking side of things because I've done so many what I'm packing for this holiday and that holiday videos. So I thought it'd be interesting to see how this one differs. So let's go. The first thing I got especially for this holiday in mind is my Herschel backpack. Now Matthew's got this one in black and I had bag envy and then Ben on tour, Ben my bass player had this and took it on tour and I had even more bag envy so I got it in the grey. It's on the kind of higher end sort of bag level of bagness, it's around 80 to 90 pounds but it's just so well made, it's got a special laptop sleeve in it, it's got loads of pockets, it feels really tough and it's so comfortable on your back. I just thought it'd be really really good just because although we have a bus which is going to be holding our stuff so obviously we're not going to walk from LA to San Francisco we've got buses a bus to take us which will house my actual suitcase this will just be my like everyday bag which I'll use for obviously my laptop my cameras spare bits of clothing any shoes any food that I want to stash in there it's just a really good size and I'm also going to be using it for my hand luggage on the plane next is my sleeping bag. I went to go outdoors and I was trying to find a sleeping bag which was really small so I could fit more stuff in my suitcase. Now they say, they give you on the itinerary like what kind of stuff you need to bring and so there's the campsites and they provide all the tents and everything. You just need to bring a sleeping bag which is awesome. The campsites I think have everything equipped like I'm pretty sure they have electricity and showers otherwise because they said that there's wi-fi, I don't know but we'll see when we get there. So I found this really small sleeping bag which obviously folds out into a regular camp camping sleeping bag and so I thought that'd be absolutely perfect to pack with me. Next on my hiking boots, now I bought these hiking boots um, because I don't have any hiking boots, I don't have anything that's practical for like climbing rocks and shit and deserts and whatever so the idea is that I'm going to wear these for my Trek America, they're super duper comfy, they're waterproof, they're really gripping but I'm also going to use them when I get home for walking the dogs. I'm also going to be taking a pair of sandals. Now I'm going to be taking my Doc Martin sandals just because I feel like they're quite hard wearing as well and they're really comfortable. I've worn them so, so much um, and they've also got a good sole on them so if I don't fancy wearing my boots and we're somewhere where we're not so rocky or hikey, I might just wear these for the day. For clothing, so I've got all my stuff for my second week but the typical kind of clothing that I'm going to be wearing whilst I'm hiking, most likely denim shorts, cycle shorts and then like an oversized t-shirt or a vest. Um, this is probably going to be what I'm going to be looking like most of the time whilst I'm on my hike. And then toiletries! So I've got a variety of different small size and large size toiletries. Um, I think it's really important that I take some insect repellent, some suntan lotion, anti back wipes, but then also I kind of want to take some things that are still going to make me feel like I'm a little bit at home, so a little bit of luxury infused. So I've got a few things, obviously I'm going to be taking all my hair products That'll be mostly for when I get back to LA. I mean, if they've got plug sockets where I can straighten my hair, then fucking bonus. I normally take a mini Lush shower gel just because they're travel size and they're awesome. And I'm also going to be taking, just because of the heat, my skin is going to need looking after. So I've got a few things from the body shop that I'm going to be taking, which are also amazing because they're travel size. The first thing I'm going to be using to look after my skin 
is the Instaglow CC Cream. This basically corrects skin tone, illuminates, moisturizes for 24 hours, minimizes the appearance of pores, and unifies, reduces shine, and UVA protection, which is great. My skin is really, really dry at the moment, and a little bit poopy, so I'm kind of really on taking care of it, and this heat, and this sun is probably not going to do it any favours, so I've got that. And then I've also got the Vitamin E Moisture Protect Emulsion, and that's got an SPF of 30, um, which is awesome. I've got a version of this in a spray. I'm going to be taking the lotion this time, just because I think it'll have a bit of a thicker coverage and make me feel like I'm sucking up more moisture <laughs> than normal. I just got these travel size shampoo and conditioners as well. Me and Matthew have got the same one. I got some face wipes, just because they're a little bit more easier, but I also did get get some makeup remover but I try and make everything as small as possible when I'm traveling just because I hate like going around like with big bottles of stuff and I will carry everything in these nice clear travel bags that I got from Boots. So that is it everybody. Um, I'm so excited about going. There is a link in the description which will link you to a competition from Trek America to win your own awesome experience. Um, I'm going to be daily vlogging still on my second channel, The Experience. Hopefully, fingers crossed that I'll have Wi-Fi and I'll be able to upload, but I will be documenting the whole thing. Thanks very much for watching. I will see you guys soon. Goodbye.